19 minutes before 9 o'clock, and this summer morning, maybe you're sitting on your back deck sipping a fresh coffee, and or maybe you're out uh, at a cafe wondering when the waitress is going to bring your eggs benedict. But Kevin Callan is enjoying a very different breakfast. He is savoring some freeze-dried breakfast delights amidst the beauty of a primeval forest. For the past couple of weeks, Kevin has been canoeing deep into the heart of Quetico Provincial Park, far from roads the electricity grid and other people but he's not totally out of touch he's got a satellite phone good morning kevin hey joe get me out of this park the bugs are crazy <laughs> so kevin explain this dirty songs on cbc comment <laughs> okay so we're on a radio show this morning talking uh with uh, jeff on fresh air on the by satellite phone and i had every chance in my you know in front of me to actually say nice things about Andy Baxter, my canoe partner that's been with me all this trip. And what do I say? I go, I can't stand the man. He's singing the same song over and over again. And what do they say on live radio? Well, what song? Well, it had to be a dirty song, so I couldn't say it. And he was a little upset about that. But I said, you tell me what song you sung this entire trip, this like three week trip that was clean. And he could not give me an answer. Wait Even the clean songs were <laughs> the lyrics were changed to be dirty. I don't believe you. Oh, yes. See, yes. see, folks, this is the fiction that you read about. Even log drivers' waltz became twisted in a weird, psychotic way. How could that innocent song about log drivers and their hard work become so twisted? I don't that's want to know. that's the evil. That's disgusting. The evil of Kevin Callan. <laughs> Changes everything. Say goodbye, Kevin.